Now, before I start the video, I would like to mention a quick disclaimer that I don't condone in the buying or selling of reps and that this is just an educational video only. Hey guys, welcome back to another YouTube video. In today's video, we're going to be reviewing some gallery department or gallery dev pants, I should say. Uh, these were about $17 when I bought it and they were about $15 or $13 when for shipping. And I got them from Pandabai, or I guess Pandabai. And they took about maybe like a week or two weeks to get here, not too long. And the shipping line that I use, I shipped it out with PD line, which is like the cheapest, I guess. Anyways, here are the pants right here. They had three different colors. Uh, they had black, gray, and they have orange. So I picked the gray because it kind of goes with everything. So let's just open the package right now. The words are good quality. As you can see, it says gallery depth, not just like cheap, like paint off words, but they're actually in there. So if you wash it, it won't come off. They also have these kind of like paint marks, I guess. Uh, they had like paint splatters. So they have like green, white, black, just like a bunch of stuff that's going on uh here's the bottom of the pants which is like flared so it's like navy blue on the left side and like black in the middle and then higher up there's also a white part which connects the pants here's the back of the pants it doesn't really have much except for like other parts of the paint nothing much just white and like black paint I was looking for flare pants, didn't know where to get one because they're like so damn expensive. So I just found these off the internet or rep and I just purchased them. So the pants also has drawstrings just in case if you want to uh, tighten the pants. But I don't think it's necessary because like as you can see right here, like the waistline is kind of like, uh, like strapped on so you don't really need it. And moving into the pants, they have the gallery department tag. They also have this tag that's right here. And then they have the sizing, which is XL. But you know me, I wear a large in the USA and I'm like six foot two. So I usually size up because I feel like the pants like kind of run small. And I would usually get like an XL or a double XL just for my secured fit but anyways here are the pants nice quality uh, kind of cut off at the bottom or flared I like it it's nice and I would definitely order a different pair of these just for like a regular day or another day so anyways I'm going to try these on Before I end off this video, I would like to point out that while I was checking out the pants that there was a stain on it. Not too big. I just need to put in a washer and wash it. Um, I would rate this review maybe like an 8.5 or 9 out of 10. Just wish that they had a bigger size. Um, I will be making a spreadsheet which will have all my links down in the description. Maybe like later today or as soon as the video get posted. And yeah, please like, share and subscribe for more videos like this. Uh, I'll see you boys in the next one. Peace.